Solar leases and power purchase agreements, also known as PPAs, allow you to take advantage of the financial and environmental benefits of solar without owning your solar panel system. Both options are similar to renting. With a solar lease, you pay a monthly fee for the system and get to use all the electricity the solar panels produce. With a PPA, you agree to purchase the electricity the system generates at prices that are lower than what you would pay your utility, only available in a limited number of states. Although solar panel systems require little to no maintenance, if something were to happen, the lease or PPA company would be responsible for any repairs, since it is the owner of the system. Generally, you sign a 20-year contract with the leasing company, and they will install the panels at your home. Where they are not available, you always have the option to get a solar loan. Since the leasing company owns the solar panel system, many of its financial benefits, things like rebates, tax credits, and incentives, would go to them. So if you're looking to maximize your investment in solar, leases and PPAs aren't the best choice. If you decide to sell your home before the end of the contract period, you can do one of two things. Option one, you can work with the new buyer and the lease or PPA company to have him or her assume the remainder of the contract. In this instance, the company would verify the buyer's creditworthiness. Option two, you can buy the system from the lease company at fair market value and then include it in the price of your home at the time of sale. A solar panel system for your home will cost between $10,000 and $20,000. If you prefer not to spend this money up front, both solar loans and solar leases are good options to finance your system. Both will allow you to install solar panels at your home with no money down. Let's start with what they have in common. Both solar loans and solar leases give you the same environmental benefits. And both usually have monthly payments that are less than your current electric bill. So regardless of what you choose, you'll be saving money and the environment. The main difference between loans and leases has to do with ownership of your system. With a loan, you borrow the money from the bank to buy your system. You will own the system and you'll pay the money back to the bank with interest over a period of 7 to 20 years. With the lease or power purchase agreement, also referred to as a PPA, you are essentially renting the system from the solar leasing company. The leasing company owns the system and you pay them each month to use the system, usually for a period of 20 years. The question of who owns the system is important because certain benefits, as well as certain responsibilities, go along with ownership. If you're looking to maximize the financial benefits solar can provide to you, then owning your system is better, so you'll want to get a solar loan. Solar loans may be the right option for you if you fit into any one of these three categories. One, you're comfortable with owning and maintaining your solar panel system. Two, your tax bill is larger than the tax credits you will receive for purchasing your panel system. Or three, you are comfortable taking out a solar loan. One final deciding factor is the availability of solar leases. Today, solar leases are only available in a handful of states, so if they aren't offered where you live, you'll have to go with the solar loan option by default. Now that you understand your options, you'll need to choose the one that's best for you.